Coach, rests and basics were what you emphasized with this extra week of time that you haven't had before. How mm -hmm. do you think your team managed the uh, extra time? I think we did a good time, a good job with it. I, uh, I it was a couple of days we really we had a really good scrimmage where I think we really got their their lungs back where they need to be. I think I'll probably press them one more time now that we know we're playing Thursday. Might press them a little bit either tomorrow or Tuesday, and then really try to shut things down a little bit Wednesday, get give them a break of sweat. So uh, just just. We're just so happy to be in it. We're so happy to be rep representing the Big Ten, be the Big Ten champion going in there. And uh, you know, I wish we could have got more teams in. I, I, I feel bad for Penn State and Nebraska, but at the same time, uh, the four that uh, are representing this great league are four really good basketball programs. Leading into this event, you mentioned to the fans, we're just happy to be here. Yeah, as yeah, you just yeah, said, yeah. you guys are headed to Wichita now. Yeah. You said you didn't know where you were going to yeah, get yeah, seated. You didn't yeah. really care. Now you are seated. What did you interpret uh, from being sent to Wichita? Well, it just, you know, it's very difficult for the committee to try and figure all these things out. And uh, anybody that's in any one of the, 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 the seeds, one through, uh, you know, it, one through really 16, but if you're in a top four seed like we are, um, that's quite a compliment. And there's some uh, and tremendous teams that are, that are four and, and five seeded right now as well. So, uh, but in the long run, it really doesn't make a difference. You know, what is the difference between a 12, 13, and 14 team? There's no difference, really. So it is a... Uh, uh, we'll have our work cut out for us, as will everybody. Will those that have two seeds or uh, all those things? There's, there's, there's tough games. I told my team I stopped practice the other day. I said, guess what? Anybody you're playing now is good, right? They didn't make the NCAA tournament if they weren't a good team. So be ready, and, and we got to practice that way. And as you just said before, and anyone that has 26 wins yeah. is a good team. Yeah. You don't know much about Montana, so how do you approach a team that you really are starting from scratch with? Well, what we'll do immediately, my, my assistants are already on their way over to the film room, and so I know we have video of them because we, we capture so much uh, stuff that goes up in the sky. We capture virtually all of it. And so in the next uh, day or two, we will find uh, out a lot about them. We'll call a lot of people. And, uh, but we'll also be able to watch video on them. And so we'll try and figure out who they are, what they do. Um, there's a lot of uh, teams that we could have played as well I knew more about, but that not necessarily isn't a good thing. Some of those teams are scary as well. So don't know anything about Montana, but what I said, 26 wins, they got to be really good. Coach, thanks so much for the All time. Right, thank you. Guys.